Torturing Jerry was my favorite thing in the world after making out with you. Remember when we did both at the same time? <laughs> it made him so uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> this is a sad day. Who are we gonna make fun of now? No need to worry. Every place I've ever worked in has had a Jerry. When one Jerry leaves, the office naturally selects a new Jerry to fill that role. It's social Darwinism, the strong prey on the weak. Soon, one of you will be ridiculed mercilessly. Ha, <laughs> nature. Here are the last animal control reports. What are you doing, weirdo? Just trying not to spill anything. I believe Leslie said to organize these by year. Way ahead of you. I made two pile files. <laughs> pile of fibles. <laughs> pile of pilos. <laughs> pile of pilos. That's not right. <laughs> Are you broken? No, everything's fine. <laughs> well, I guess that settles who the new Jerry is. <laughs> no, it doesn't. I barely even said it wrong. You said it wrong. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> this is how it begins. The next Jerry. One screwed up sentence. And 30 years later, I'm wearing aquamarine sweater vests and listening to Bonnie Raitt and the Da Vinci Code on my iPod. <laughs> <laughs> so did he start. Hey, if it isn't Philo Pilo. Oh, real creative, Donna. You expect that to catch on? Babe, the pen. Ah! <laughs> Look at Andy. What? Hey, he's ink all over him. Hey, Andy's the new Jerry. Oh. Game over. <laughs> awesome. Hey, I'm like a giant squid. Hey, honey, I'm Ink Dracula. No, stop. Squid Dracula, boy, did you get you? Parking up the wrong tree, Philo. What do you mean? Andy will never be the new Jerry. Nothing embarrasses him. He's like a giant puppy with no shame. What you need is some fresh meat in the office. Or you guys could just stop making fun of me. Yeah, no. Ron Fire of the Vanities. Philo Pilo. Are you kidding me? Listen. Now that Jerry's gone, we need to hire someone to pick up the slack. A new person in the office? Not a person, an intern. Why on earth would I get an intern? Interns cost nothing to the taxpayer. And more importantly, they're usually stupid and terrible, so they get no work done. It's like a Jerry you don't have to pay. Damn, son, that is one compelling argument. Keep it up, Philo. We may destroy this government one day after all. So, you want to get out of here? Work just started, Miss Meagle. Yeah, but our work is just beginning, you know what I'm saying? Oh, Donna, who's the new boy toy? I'm Taylor, the new intern. This is the new intern? Are you kidding me? Yeah, he went to high school with my sister Natalie. He was a big deal on the football team. Oh, meat, meathead jock type, huh? Actually, I quit football senior year so I could help my pastor run a homeless shelter. Oh, pfft. this guy loves the homeless so much he should marry him, right? Anybody would be lucky to marry him. Hey, Taylor, do you want to marry me in April? Wish I could, man, but I'm not a marriage dude. I've got a lot of love to give and it just seems unfair to put boundaries on it. He gets it. You so get it. Ron, ask me if I'm sad. No. Ron, I'm the new Jerry. Well, is whining gonna do anything about it? You don't wanna be a whipping boy, stand up for yourself. You don't understand, Ron. I already was Jerry. I was a skinny Indian kid in South Carolina, and it sucked. It took me 12 years, but I reinvented myself. I'm a business owner. I wear dope suits. I have fur underwear. But it was all for nothing. Back to being a Jerry. All right, I'm gonna go buy some sweatpants and a Nicholas Sparks novel. Might as well lean into it. Tom can take care of himself. He's a grown man. Well, half grown. He does have a business where he rents out his clothes to 12-year-olds. Hey. What are you doing here, Jerry? I thought you were fired. I wasn't fired. I retired. That's what they all say. I asked Jerry to come in. That new intern wasn't working out, so I got rid of him. Once again, I object in the strongest possible terms. Once again, noted. I have also asked Jerry to come in a couple hours a week until we find a permanent replacement. Ah, oh, just when we were rid of him? Yeah, I don't know, Ron. Are you hearing me, son? Jerry will come in once a week, and everyone will get to watch him eat and talk to him about anything he might do or say or fart. Welcome back, Jerry. Oh, thank you. Oh, it feels good just to be back. <laughs> Classic new guy.